Hello and welcome to my summer night routine. Summer is almost over, so I've been soaking up these long summer nights before it comes to an end. So on this day, I got home around 4 p.m. and it was such a hot day in the Florida heat. So first thing I had to do was grab a cup of ice cold water. And then I just grabbed my phone out of my bag and took a little seat in my favorite blue chair and just caught up on social media and emails and anything happening on my phone. I truly have to take this time just to cool down after being outside because it is so hot and I really enjoy just sitting down for a minute or two right when I get home. After I cool down, I set my purse down in my room and take off my hat and jewelry. Whenever I come home and I'm just tired from the day, I always just want to throw all my clothes and shoes and accessories all in a little pile, but even though this was a lazy night, I still like to put everything in its proper place so that my room and apartment stays tidy, which keeps me inspired. Since I was outside for most of the day and I really wanted to just clean off, I decided to take a nice relaxing bubble bath. Baths are truly the epitome of self-care and pampering and relaxing and I truly do love baths, especially if you have a good book or you listen to some relaxing music, which is what I did on this day. I also stuck in a bath bomb and lit some candles. I just did the most to make it a premium bath experience. soaking and relaxing in the bath. I actually took a shower because although I do enjoy baths, I don't think they're the most effective way to clean your body and shave and all that good stuff. So I did that in the shower. And before I shower, I just take off my makeup with a makeup wipe or makeup remover pad just because my face wash doesn't always take off all my mascara. So I like to give it a head start. After my shower, I just applied some lotion and moisturized my body. And then I went to change to some comfy, cozy clothes. So I'm wearing this Live Your Dream pullover, which is actually part of my merch. And I just absolutely love it. It is so incredibly comfy. And it's such a good reminder every time you put it on to live your dream and believe in yourself. I personally think it's super cute and fun. So I slid that on. I truly have been living in this pullover sweatshirt. It is so cozy. <laughs> and I just paired it with some leggings just to be as comfy as could be. You can shop my merch down below if you're interested in matching with me and you can check out what else I have. Also, you gotta make sure your feet are nice and cozy. So I slid into my slippers as well. Now it's time for a face mask. So I use this one from Youth of the People and it has all these healthy ingredients. It truly is like eating a power meal for your face and I really enjoy it. So while my face mask was sitting, I just went over to my little desk area and went on the computer 
Brandon and I are planning a little trip, so I like to go on Pinterest and kind of make a bucket list and work on our itinerary. It's one of my favorite things to do. I love it so much. And I just love Pinterest in general, so I love spending time each day getting inspired. After I have some dust time, I figured it was time to start on dinner. So since this was a lazier night, we just had frozen pizza and we really like the Amy's organic frozen pizza. But even though we really like this pizza, we usually add a few more veggies to it just because we love peppers and onions and all that good stuff. So I just chopped up some little mini bell peppers and I already had some onions chopped up so that was super easy. And then I also made a little side salad to pair with it. Arugula is definitely my favorite kind of lettuce for salad. It is so yummy and you don't even have to chop it up that much because the leaves are so small. Also, I love to add sunflower seeds and fresh ground pepper to my salad for some extra flavor. I added all the extra flair and flavors to our pizza. I just popped it in the oven. While it was heating up, Brandon and I decided it would be fun to make our own little cozy fort. We haven't done this in so long, actually since there was a hurricane last year in Florida, so it was so fun and kind of frustrating at first to figure out how to make a fort, but it turned out really cute and I just added all these fun twinkle lights and it was like we were having dinner under the stars in our little apartment. While we ate dinner under our fort, we just watched funny YouTube videos. Some of our favorite comedians are John Crist and Trey Kennedy. They're so funny and we love watching them. So that's just what we did. And for dessert, we actually had these leftover desserts from one of our favorite restaurants. So we chowed down on these churros and key lime pie. Now that we were done eating, I wanted to get all clean and brush my teeth. So. I love this toothpaste. It's actually from Walmart, but it's kind of like Tom's toothpaste. And then I also use a tongue cleaner, which I love. And for my little skincare, I won't go in depth, but I use this Restoring Night Serum from Skin Laundry and then this Good Jeans Serum from Sunday Riley. So I just apply those. And then for my eyelashes, I actually apply castor oil with a little Q-tip because apparently it helps them grow nice and long. And then of course I had to add my little pimple cream. <laughs> I get so many pimples on my chin, so I always try to add a little drying lotion to get them out of there. And now it is time to sleep. I just love crawling in bed at the end of the night with my husband. I really hope you all enjoyed this summer night routine and soak up the last bits of summer, but thank you for watching and sweet dreams.